Everyday Math is a program that's rich in authentic learning experiences. These are 21st century learning skills, collaboration, cooperation, and problem solving. Everyday Math matches perfectly with the new technology that's available to our students, and we feel confident that they will go into the world prepared to take on any challenges. For the past seven years, we've been using a wonderful program for our math curriculum. That's Everyday Math. Everyday Math is a research-based program used by over four million children worldwide. School-wide, our math teachers are thrilled to see the advancement of our students, their ability to do more than we would ever expect students at their age to be able to do and the test scores definitely prove that. I started teaching everyday math at another school and it was amazing to see the difference between what I had learned because it was the same school I grew up in and I noticed that the children no matter what their needs were, I taught it with special needs children and gifted children, they all were succeeding very well in this. And when I came here, that was one of the reasons why I wanted to work here. Understanding that student engagement is always a key piece in being able to teach a young child. We were thrilled to find out that children are actually saying to us, can we have more math time? Is it time for us to get out our math things? And that's a really unusual thing for us to have heard in the past when we were using a more traditional method. When we first brought out the materials for everyday math, I think they were really astonished. The children couldn't believe that math had to do with using these really fun objects. Oftentimes, they have an opportunity to learn a concept, then use that concept with those hands-on items. For instance, they might use straws and twist ties to make the shapes that they've talked about. They would then use those same shapes and be able to measure perimeter, and then talk about area when it comes to those three-dimensional objects that they're making. Children also have the opportunity to move from that more concrete moment of understanding into the abstract. Children might be making something out of a geometric tile formation, then they could move from that point to using the same shapes with a template, and then understand the whole idea of patterning at different levels. In addition to that, children are able to use money and understand the concept of what the money means, and then actually role play using that money just as they would do in everyday opportunities. The real world application with the everyday math is consistent. It offers the children to go back on experiences that they've previously had and bring that into the math classroom. Such as an array, you're using a marching band to explain how you're going to line up the base 10 blocks and um, show me what three times six is. What's really great is I can differentiate the instruction and uh, the math series offers different materials and ideas to do that by providing different units of manipulatives to different students. One of the innovative concepts that's used in everyday math is to employ games for children so that they'll have an opportunity to practice those same facts that we used to use flashcards to memorize, and now they're using those facts so that they can be successful in a game. That's highly motivating, and the children are truly engaged in learning those math facts because they have a purpose. In my classroom, each Friday, we have game day, and that day is set aside for nothing but math games, and the math games are tailored to the lessons that we've taught all week. So the children are applying the skills that they've learned all week into a game and having fun with friends and um, making it a team effort to solve a problem. One very unique and exciting important component of everyday math is the opportunity to go back and revisit concepts so that we can really strengthen those. That opportunity comes with our math box pages. They show up throughout the lessons and give children an opportunity to go back and practice again something they may have learned a week ago, a month ago, or even a year ago to make sure that they're still understanding it and that they are growing in the process. The parent involvement piece of everyday math has been a great way for us to expand our math program into our homes also. Each parent receives a family letter at the beginning of every unit and then the children can share with their parents what they're exploring and what they're understanding as they move through each unit. There are also games that can be played at home and some do-at-home activities that will strengthen their math skills and help them to build those very important math facts. Parents are able to access even more information about everyday math by visiting the school website and finding the link there. Creators of this program have done a lot of background work and actually they've done some of the hardest work for the teachers. 
They've embedded skills in lots of different activities, and so as you present these activities to the children, they're getting a really solid foundation on a variety of skills without even knowing it. The teachers can teach the program and know that as they spiral through the curriculum, they're going to go back, they're going to readdress certain skills, and then the children come out of this with having had an engaging moment with math, but at the same time very solid foundation in all the skills that they need. One of the things that I find um, rewarding as a teacher is that the math series goes across the curriculum. So not only are we learning math, but in the fact if we're learning um, number stories, we can actually be writing and using punctuation and grammar in math because they're asking the children and challenging them by writing their own number stories. One experience that we had after we started working with everyday math is we actually had teachers walking around saying, I wish we had used this method when I was in school. We all realized we would have had a better understanding and a lot of our questions would have been answered along the way instead of just doing it because it was supposed to be done that way. I found myself able to do mental math so much better in my everyday existence and so I was able to work out problems in my head without having to have paper and pencil as I had all of my life up until that point. Over the years we've had the opportunity to grow and develop using everyday math. We still find new ways to use the program, but probably the most exciting aspect is to watch our children grow. Their ability to apply knowledge and to take a new problem and solve it using whatever strategy works best for them is by far one of the best aspects of this. After years of working with everyday math in our classrooms, we are so happy to report that we see our students every day becoming engaged, confident, and empowered as they become lifelong learners of math.